TitleMatchNetwork.com. Well, see, I tried to get Scotty to come in uh, with uh, Dusty and the UWF. I mean, we sat out of his office for two hours waiting for Dusty to see us. He didn't even he ended up having meetings and doing all the shit. He wanted to see us, you know. Right. So my brother just went back and did that. And then um, um, I brought it to him again in 89 after the uh, – I split off with Rotunda and everything else, and, and Flair, and Flair, and uh, oddly enough, I think it was Flair, Oli, uh, Flair, and Dusty, and somebody else ended up bringing them in, putting us together. Did you keep in touch with him a lot when he was in uh, USWA in Memphis? Um, yeah, um, uh, you know, I'd, I'd see him, you know, we talked a lot, uh, Call my telephone, tell him what was going on, you know, stuff we were doing. Yeah, I still kept in contact with him. What are your memories of the match you guys had with the Nasty Boys? I think it was at Halloween Havoc. Oh, yeah, Halloween Havoc, Chicago. Um, I know they were just getting started. They'd, they'd been in the business. They were, um, they were wanting to go to New York, and I know they were having problems here uh, at WCW. They, they were just, you know, they were, they were Brian and, and Sags were some good guys. Um and uh, I know they were wanting to go up to New York. They had a half deal already done. Right. And uh, so they came in, gave them a finish, and, and I remember Sag saying, we need a good match because we're going up to events, you know. So I said, let's just you know, let's go as hard as we can. So we went at it, and I remember when we had my brother down, I had that chair. He goes, just hit me. You know, so I like <laughs> the shit out of him. That's what everybody remembers, you know, that chair shot and just all, right. all the crazy stuff, you know, the wild stuff we did. Did yeah. any of the workers ever refuse or complain about Evil Scott style? Because I remember yeah. reading about it all the time. Yeah. Well, um, back when uh, uh, Turner first started it, we had these TV matches. So it was never, you know, uh, top guys against top guys. never middle guys against middle guys right. or, or anything. So everything with TV, you wrestled. Um, the, these guys that they bring in from Florida or wherever else, right, hadn't been on TV or anything. And... Um, so when we got out there, hell, we were just getting getting started, getting over it. Hell, we, you know, so we were overly aggressive. Right. You know, and, and uh, we wouldn't really hurt the guys. I mean, hurt them, hurt them, or, you know, um, you know, break, breaking bones or anything like that. But, you know, we were, we were laying them in, you know, stuff like that. And a lot of guys had a lot of problems with, with that. Anybody that you remember in particular? Uh... I remember, well, there's a few. But I remember clothesline. When I got a screw in my bicep here. And I remember clothesline. When I started doing that clothesline, I'd, I'd, I'd throw it as hard as I could. And I remember catching Gary here and busting his teeth going through his lip at center stage. Um, I remember a guy messing up a, a couple moves with my brother. My brother just beating the living shit out of him for real. You know, just punching right, him. Right. I'm not trying to kill him, but right. punch him. And then I remember... Another time in uh, <laughs> in um, Perry, Georgia, we wrestled a kid that was half blind, and I didn't know it. <laughs> and he didn't know it at the time. And I can't remember what the guy's name is, but uh, he kind of messed up the finish, and we come back, we were pissed. And there was a kid there, a blonde-headed guy. He had blonde hair, and he had a dark beard, and I can't remember his name anymore. But he he, he made he thought he kind of thought it was funny. All right, and. and uh, he pissed my brother out both of us off. We ended up just beating the shit out of him in the locker room right there. But, uh, you know, it was one of those things, you know, you guys are stiff and you guys are rough. But in, in the end, I think that's what helped us, you know. TitleMatchNetwork.com.